Hello everyone, this is Murky again and uh, today I am going to talk about the upcoming collection of Louis Vuitton which is called Wild at Heart. If you are new to this channel, my name is Murphy and I am a CA in Louis Vuitton Neon City store. I am here to bring you an honest review, an honest opinion in a perspective of a CA in each and every new collection that we were having. This is the first time that I'm going to do a review about the upcoming collection. Usually I will do a review of the bags that is already in the store, but this time I will show you what are the items, what is, what are the inspiration, and the things that you should look out for, the things that you should pre-order before it's too late. Now let's start Wild at Heart. Why is it called Wild at Heart? It's actually a fall 2021 collection. If you were to see the pictures in this collection, because I believe there's none in any of the stores at the moment, but if you were to see it, it has a lot of like leopard print on it. It is actually inspired by the feeling of freedom and it's about reckoning the time that you clients, us clients travel around Africa, safari, desert, savanna, and all these exotic places. Most of the tones of this bag are soft and neutral. Um, it has a lot of warm terra, like it's like a terracotta kind of uh, shade. It is also kind of inspired by the archives of Louis Vuitton. They always do this. They actually incorporate the history of the past collections that they have in archives and uh, connect it with the current collection that we have right now. So uh, there are two materials, uh, the leather and the canvas. Actually, there's another category, which is the high-end canvas. Uh, we're talking about the capuchins and so forth. And I'm going to show you all that in this video. So uh, just to remind you that this item is a pre-fall collection. Um, pre-fall collection is actually um, very limited pieces. So whatever I'm going to show you right now are um, the items that are coming to Singapore. But sometimes these items are already sold out from the pre-order itself so um, with all the bags that I'm going to, do, to to show you right now it is not 100% that you're gonna see them in the store if you happen to like some of them please approach your SA your favorite SA or you can contact me as well for pre-ordering or or how it works but for now let's get started with the upcoming collection for Wild at Hearts Now let's start with the leather collection. These are the Ompron collection, which are the embossed um, monogram. Let's start with On The Go MM. On The Go MM is in brown and black with the leopard print on the side. Uh, on The Go MM is of course the same size as the classic On The Go. Um, it is a very practical bag for office or for um, just for every day if you carry a lot of things if you're a mommy it's actually a very very good bag to have this is um in a very neutral color so you don't have to worry about matching it with uh, with all your outfits um, it has a strap inside which you cannot see in this picture but um you can actually shoulder strap it aside from uh, carrying as a handbag of course there's always the never full in every season's collection never full is also in on prom leather uh, it comes in white and black um if you're wondering what kind of white it is i haven't seen this in person as well but i am guessing i'm just guessing that it would be in like a cream white because that's how the colors of the Ompron leathers are in a like in a white color so uh, i don't think it's gonna be white white it's gonna be in kind of cream i will give you an update maybe in my instagram what it looks like once it comes in the store also uh the strap looks like it's thicker than the usual monogram never full bags or the usual never full bags uh it looks thicker but again i am not quite sure but with the details of like the stitching stitching look like it looks like a large stitching effect so probably the thickness of the strap of this never full is thicker than the usual never full strap and we have the speedy 25 speedy 25 you have this beige terracotta kind of color on the side there is this leopard print and the strap is also also has this stitching stitching kind of effect and of course it comes with a strap the strap of this is not like the normal speedy in canvas um it looks like 
it only comes in two parts and it is also adjustable but the monogram bandolier strap comes in three parts so uh, if you you've already seen that it's not gonna be like that it's only this one is only in two parts but it is adjustable which is important uh, speedy 25 is a kind of a medium bag if you are in more on the petite side this is a good size for you because speedy 30 is actually a little bit too bulky mostly for a typical petite asian height and moving on with the Petite Mal Supple. Now, Petite Mal Supple is a kind of a new bag. It was only launched last year. Uh, it is inspired by the Petite Mal. So this only comes in the cream color, um, which is more on the like lighter side. So um, it is nice. It comes with a tag again with leopard print. It's in monogram and an adjustable strap. But if you're gonna if you're gonna get this color, you have to be careful with the color transfers. From the fabric of your clothes to uh, to the surface of the bag because it's gonna be hard to remove that already if you already stained it and uh, moving on we have the multi pochette accessoire the multi pochette accessoire in leather actually it's quite popular nowadays when we launched this this is a hot cake until now it is still certainly like a hot cake because it's actually uh, multi-function you can wear it as a crossbody shoulder bag with a chain formal clutch you name it there's a lot of function for this bag but if uh, comparison with the classic this looks more fun and casual because uh, the classic ones that we have are uh, in plain colors and the, the bi color is just very simple so uh, having that leopard print on the side actually makes it more fun and uh, for small leather goods for the full leather items uh, we have the pochette felici um, the pochette melanie which is something new honestly i haven't seen this before and uh, nice mini uh, in cream if you want a nice funky toiletry bags when you travel uh, this nice mini is actually very cute we have the zippy wallet in cream and in black same comp same compartments as the classic zippy wallet pochette clay that you can use for your cards and keys if you need it or if you don't you can just buy it for a collection and of course the twist i love the twist uh, we have it in mm and pm the pm is in cream the mm is in brown and black we also have the pm in leopard print and another one the pm in black with uh the thicker strap it's gonna look more casual than the other three that i have showed you now um with the leather we have normal leather which are the ompron leather but we also have a high-end leather which is in capuchines uh, capuchine is the cream of the crop of our uh bags it's actually kind of a high-end bag if you are a louis vuitton collector this is a must-have for your collection the two that's in um, Wild at Heart seasonal collection would be the black and the cream. Uh, as you can see in the image, the black looks sophisticated and elegant um, and the cream looks fun and funky. If there are two choices of each and every bag, I usually like white but this time I really love the black. I don't know, it's just the leopard print actually makes it, makes it different and makes it look like you know i am serious and uh, elegant but at the same time i have this hidden dark funny side of me does that make sense uh, the capuchin's wallet only comes in um white and black i don't have the image of the black but it comes with black as well now with a canvas collection the canvas collection is inspired by a hand-drawn book from our archives that is from 1924 so uh this is actually very significant to our history and they made it cute for the modern times okay let's start with the on the go gm so we have the leather in mm but we have the gm for the canvas collection uh, the designs are very cute and fun. You still have the leopard print for the tag. The brown is called Wild Arizona, which is like a beige, like a beige brown color. So cute. And the black, of course, the black with the pink, with the pink monogram flowers. Super cute. Never full, of course. Never full MM in canvas is always a good choice because it's very lightweight i'll go for the white for this this is actually super duper cute this is so me so girly so fun it looks so carefree and at the same time like this brown monogram flowers just signifies like a more um a younger take for a monogram print so yep love the white 
the black of course if you're concerned about getting it dirty then go for the black it also looks fun but not as fun as the white i'll go for the white next one is um the neo no way neo no way is also a very very great bag for everyday use um it's lightweight you can fit a lot of things but it's not as big as neverfull if you think that the neverfull is too big for you and you just want a casual bag neo no way is also a good choice i i don't know why but i like the black for this i just feel like the white looks better in neverfull and the black looks better in neo no way the white is cute too ah i'm confused but both are nice and both are very very spacious inside if you haven't tried the classic yet um you can go for this if you want something unique and something limited and not a lot of people has then go for the seasonal collection all the time and uh, speedy 25 only comes in one color and it also comes in pochette and mentis of course in brown and it looks like the colors has been reversed for both and yay we have keep all 45 for your travel if it's in canvas so even if it's a big bag i'm guessing that it's very lightweight and i love it now uh felicis trap and go is also a thing for this felicis trap and go is a small bag i have a review for the classic felicis trap and go um two months ago uh if you want to know about the space and what fits inside you can go and uh, check on it it's the same size it's just a different color um pochette toiletries this is for to this is for your toiletries originally but a lot of people are using it as a normal clutch bag it comes with the beige one and the black so if you're looking for a clutch bag you can go for this i love the beige but it's up to you if you're a black person go ahead just uh, make sure that you pre-ordered it before the launch because toiletry 26 are one of the items is always going to be sold out even before the launch just from the pre-order and of course for a small leather good we have the rosalie wallet it's a coin purse wallet which is super duper um, convenient if you always carry small bags it's enough to fit your cards and your coins and you can just fold your bills um like one time into half is that how you call it and just uh, slot it in it, it can actually fit zippy coin is also a very durable wallet that you can have uh it's only in cream but um it is actually a ba a wallet that looks small but you can fit a lot inside but of course there's no bill compartment in it you have to fold your bill to be able to fit but we don't carry much bills nowadays so i don't think it's really necessary to have a bill um compartment we have uh the simple card holder which is just the flat one it can fit three or maybe four to five depends on how much you want to squeeze in your cards inside um this is good for your like easy link cards tap tap cards it is also something unique and of course it comes with zippy wallet as well in uh, noir in black and in cream so that's it i hope you find something that you like out of this collection um one tip is that please if you if your ca told you that it's open for collection and you really find it attractive to your eyes i would highly highly suggest to pre-order it before the launch because you have higher chance of getting seasonal collections uh, when it's pre-ordered however it's not 100 percent confirmed because like you know it's all very limited pieces i don't know about the policy um in your country about um, the refund if uh, the item didn't if your pre-order didn't come but please contact your uh, favorite CA in this matter if you are in Singapore you can contact me if you find something that you will truly truly like my phone number is written down below you can also follow me on my Instagram I update all the new arrivals in the store or just in case that this items already in the store just in case you want to see it first before ordering and I would also explain to you how uh, pre-ordering works this is a pre-fall collection so um it's a seasonal collection there are only very limited pieces so if you want to get your hands on it and own one pre-order before the launch or if you want to see it in person i understand um just follow me on my instagram or message me so i can update you if the item is already here i don't know if i missed anything if you have further questions just comment down below or pm me whatsapp me in my um whatsapp or my instagram let me know which are the items that you love just comment down below and if you'd like to know more videos about louis vuitton bags and reviews and new arrival just follow me and subscribe to my channel so you will be updated for the new arrivals and the upcoming collection for now this is murphy again and i will see you on my next video bye bye